going on. I want to speak to Ms. Evany and let's make it happen. And the rest is history. So it was sort of, you know, you get to a point and he's not getting younger, you know, where you feel like the world still doesn't get me. And is there a platform where I can just say what's on my mind? I walked away from that interview kind of feeling like, okay, he said it in the interview. He said, I feel a sense of unfinished business. The Museveni, and I'm not speaking in favor of him or anything. Museveni is a real Pan-Africanist, just very intolerant of dissent. Just like Muammar Gaddafi. If Uganda is not an easy country, see the positioning of that country geographically. See all the countries it is, it is surrounded by. You need a very strong leadership in an area like that, but not the type that then suppresses voices. And I asked him about Changulani. I said, uh, Bobby Wine, you, doesn't Bobby Wine remind you of yourself when you were younger? Why is it so hard to accommodate him? These were questions we had to talk about. And I do not agree with everything. I asked him about his human rights record you know, suppressing the media, et cetera. So this way, this way, I mean, the, the podcast, the whole thing on caught on diluted is going to be up on my podcast, on my, on my website very soon. But I walked away from the interview, getting to know this man better, which also explains why a lot of founding fathers, a lot of uh, presidents who fought uh, hard for their country as soon as, you know, after, after independence felt the need to see something through. The only person who showed that it could be done another way was Nelson Mandela. And I always kind of put that notion into my interviews when I'm talking to these people. You don't have to be there. Your real success is after you've done what you can, you move away and see the younger generation take on. We will die someday. Why hang on to it by all means necessary? So it was one of my, I had really, I enjoyed the, it was the, the, the interview a lot. Um, uh, and um, I hope to do more of that.